Hey, it's Robert with Clean Pool and Spa, and in this video, I'm going to answer another question of the day. And this question comes from Randall. He says, The guy at the pool store said I need to drain my pool every two to three years. I also saw a video, and the guy said the same thing. I think that's a bit excessive and expensive, but wanted your opinion on the matter. When do you think my pool should be drained? Well, that's an excellent question, and we're going to cut right through it all and get to the truth. Now what most people will tell you is to do a full drain and refill every two to three years or when the TDS or total dissolved solids are about 1500 parts per million or higher. But what is TDS comprised of? Here we see one person's definition of TDS which is fairly accurate. But the thing about it is we would need to take a sample of our pool water to a professional lab to determine exactly what our TDS is. And even if we do that, we would need to run more tests to determine if a slightly higher TDS level is really bad for our pool chemistry and our situation. You see, we simply can't make a wide statement such as, oh, your TDS is at 1700 parts per million. You must drain the pool right now because you're going to get chlorine lock or chlorine block or any of that other crap that people say. And it's bad for your pool to have such a high level of TDS. So how about this? You can fill your pool with fresh water and then add enough salt to reach 3,500 parts per million and then have your TDS tested. And guess what? Your TDS will read at least 3,500 parts per million on a newly filled salt pool. Now the last time I checked, 3,500 parts per million is greater than 1,500 parts per million. So does this mean I should drain my newly filled salt pool because my TDS is at 3,500 parts per million? You see, my friends, we can't go on the simple analogy of having our TDS at X. Therefore, X equals drain and refill. We have this saying called causation versus correlation, and I've talked about that in previous videos. So when should we drain our pools? Well, there's really only a few reasons. First is if your pool requires some kind of service, such as replastering, painting, or repairs. Or in the case of severe staining, that requires a chlorine or acid wash. And from a chemical perspective, you should only do a partial full drain and refill if the stabilizer is too high. But simply because it's, hey, uh, June 21st, 2019, and the next time I'll drain the pool will be June 21st, 2021, is wrong, expensive, and wasteful. And there you have it, another question of the day answered. I'm Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. Check out the description box below. Link to my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. Lots of great information over there. Like, subscribe, and comment here. As always, be safe and happy swimming. Bye.